In young and fit patient, I believe autologous stem cell transplantation uh, remains the standard of care. And this has been proven and shown in uh, different randomized trials, especially recently the so-called determination trial, which is a phase three randomized trial performed in the US, which could show that uh, the transplant arm compared to the non-transplant arm can allow for a significantly higher progression-free survival. Obviously, and this is always uh, where the devil is in the details, there's no difference in overall survival in the overall population. However, given the magnitude of the difference in terms of PFS, we believe that even at the era of novel agent used for induction, like the quadruplet regimens, uh, DARA VTD or DARA VRD, daratumumab, bortezomib, thalidomide, dexamethasone, daratumumab, bortezomib, lenalidomide, dexamethasone, still, uh, at, uh, in this uh, uh, young and fit population, we believe autotransplant uh, will uh, remain a standard of care for the next few years.